Today we're going to discuss the Maxwell Coat of Arms. But before we get started, we wanted to let you know that we offer genealogy research service at our website. Please visit us at coadb.com. We have many, many arms to discuss, so we're going to go through them very quickly. And they are in no particular order. The first here says... Sir David Maxwell was created first baronet of Cardonis in 1804. He was the son of Major John Maxwell and the grandson of Colonel William Maxwell. It's a quarterly coat of arms with the crest and supporters. Now, another, we have William Maxwell of Cardonis, quarterly, another quarterly coat of arms. And a list of the Maxwell baronets of Cardonis all the way through the fourth baronet who died in 1924. A baronetcy was essentially a hereditary knighthood. Another for William Maxwell of Locke. One for Patrick Maxwell of Newark in the year 1532. One for Reverend Hugh Maxwell, Minister of Strathmartine from 1748 to 1754. The Maxwell, later Maxwell, later Sterling Maxwell, Baronetcy of Pollock in the county of Renfrew, is a title created in the Baronetage of Nova Scotia in 1682. For Sir John Maxwell, a Scottish politician and lawyer who was the son of Sir George Maxwell of Aldhouse and Pollock. And I have a note here that says there was an earlier creation of the baronetcy for Sir John Maxwell, first baronet, born 1583. Here we see a list of the Maxwell baronets. And I believe Pollock House, family estate. Coat of arms of Patrick Maxwell of Dargavel in Renfrew, Scotland, who was alive in the year 1605. John Maxwell of Barn Clue, County Kirk Cudbright, 1672, a cadet branch of Maxwell of Kirk Connell. Patrick Maxwell of Teeling or Tellin in County Forfar. He descended from a brother of the first Lord Maxwell. John Maxwell of Lackey Banks, 1676 a cadet branch of Maxwell of Teeling. Alexander Maxwell of Calderwood, County Lanark, a cadet branch of the Maxwell Baronets of Pollock, 1627 creation. Robert Maxwell of Carn Salick in Dumfries, descended from a younger son of the first Lord Maxwell. Sir Alexander Maxwell of Monreath, County Wigton, a cadet branch of Maxwell of Tinwald, baronetcy awarded in 1681 to William Maxwell of Monreath. We see a list of the Maxwell baronets all the way through the ninth baronet who died in 2021. The Earl of Morton, John Maxwell, born 1553, was the seventh or eighth Lord Maxwell. He was conferred the title of Earl of Morton. His mother, Lady Beatrice Douglas, was the daughter of the third Earl of Morton. Earl of Nisdale was a title in the Peerage of Scotland created in 1620 for Robert Maxwell, 9th Lord Maxwell. His son was Robert Maxwell, 2nd Earl. William Maxwell, 5th Lord Harrys of Terry Gulls, son of Agnes Harrys and Sir John Maxwell, 2nd son of the 5th Lord Maxwell. Here we have the family estate. Robert Maxwell was created the first baronet of Orchard Town in 1663, son of Sir Robert Maxwell of Spottis and the same locale, a title dormant since 1786. Here we see, it looks like a tower, castle tower the family owned or was involved with at some point. And then later we have Orchard Town House. 
coat of arms of Major General Thomas Maxwell, who died in 1693, a Scottish professional soldier. His family was Roman Catholic and were a cadet branch of Maxwell of Kirkconnell. He was appointed Colonel of Prince Anne of Den Princess Anne of Denmark's regiment. Here we see his wife as well. I believe her name was Jane. The Maxwell, later Heron Maxwell, Baronetcy of Springkell and Dumfries, a title in the Baronetage of Nova Scotia, created in 1683 for Patrick Maxwell. Here we see a list of the baronets all the way through the ninth baronet who died in 1982. As well as Springkell's house, I believe, the family estate. Francis Maxwell of New Law and Kirkconnell, also used by Edward Maxwell of Lamington, who died in 1596. The arms itself is that of Thomas Maxwell of Liverpool, 1865. Maxwell of Broomholm, matriculated by John Maxwell of Broomholm in 1759, descended from John Maxwell, first of Bloomholm, a descendant of the third Lord Maxwell. Maxwell of Breedland and Renfrew, 1789. Not sure on this one, but we do know there was a Hugh Maxwell, Lord of Breedland, who was born around 1574, the son of Arthur Maxwell. Sir Edward Maxwell, born 1405, was First Lord of Tinwall. He was the second son of Herbert, First Lord Maxwell. Maxwell of Hills in County Kirkcudbright. Hills is barony to the south of Dumfries, originally owned by a son of Lord Maxwell in the 16th century and later was the home of Edward Maxwell, vicar of Carlaveric. Maxwell of Kirkconnell. The last male of this line was James Maxwell, born 1759, son of James Maxwell, who died in 1762. Earlier, there was William Maxwell of Kirkconnell, a man-at-arms to King James V. The progenitor of the family was Amer Maxwell, who married an heiress of the Kirkconnell family in the 15th century. Here we see Kirkconnell House, the family estate. Maxwell of Dull Winston, lands purchased by John Maxwell in 1649, said to be a brother of Robert Maxwell of Orcherton, had daughter Marion, who married Hugh Maxwell, the son of George Maxwell of Aldhouse. Uh, Maxwell of William Wood. Maxwell descended from John Maxwell of William Wood, born in 1675, deputy sheriff of Renfrew, who had sons James, Henry, and John. And William Maxwell, Esquire of Birdstown in the 18th century. And if you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com. Link in the description. Thank you very much.